This video will show you how to add stairs to your house. Now because you typically look down on your stairs, we have what's called that bird's eye view, which means we're going to be crossing over to the opposite vanishing point. We're going to begin our stairs by starting at the very bottom of our door. So on that corner where the bottom of our door matches up with the top of the foundation, we're going to connect that to the vanishing point on the opposite side. Again, this is because we're doing bird's eye view. We're going to bring that line out just a little ways and now go to the other side of that door. Crossing over to the opposite vanishing point, we're going to bring that line out. Now we need to connect those two lines. So the vanishing point that makes the most sense is going to be the vanishing point on the right. So let's connect those two lines together, but make sure you match up with the vanishing point on the right. You always want to be on a vanishing point with those receding parallel lines. Never just make that line up, otherwise it's going to look completely wrong. So right now I have what's kind of looking like a doormat. And I need to give that stair some elevation, so I'm going to create two vertical lines that come straight down. So I'm going to match up the edge of the ruler with the edge of the paper. Right there. And I'm going to bring that corner line down. And go over to the other side, bring that corner line down. Now let's connect those two lines together. But again, the only one that really makes sense to connect them to is going to be the vanishing point on the right. So I line everything up and we connect back. And there you have one step that's done. Alright, let's practice that again by making another step. We're going to start at the corner of the bottom of that step and cross over again to the opposite vanishing point. So we'll bring it out, go over to the other side, bring it out. Now let's connect back to the vanishing point on the same side. And after we have this line, our next step would be to add some elevation, except we're going to try to figure out first how far out we need to bring our stairs. So we're going to extend the line from our door, the left side of it, you're going to bring it all the way down to your foundation line. We're then going to match up that line with your vanishing point on the opposite side, and we're going to bring that line out. Again, we're trying to figure out how many more steps we really need to put in. So let's go a little bit further. And from here, now let's go back and finish off that step. Let's add in our elevation match up the edge of the ruler with the edge of the paper and bring those lines straight down. We're then going to connect back to the va vanishing point on the same side. And as you can see, we can fit in at least one more step because we still have that line that's not connected to anything. So to review, you cross over, cross over, connect back, drop down, drop down, connect back. Again, cross over, cross over, connect back, drop down, drop down, connect back. It's just that whole thing repeated over and over again, however many times you need it. Okay, so with mine I needed to add at least one more step in there, and when I did so, I still had a little bit of a tail left over from that line, so I erased that out, and when you finish, you'll have something like so.